It's finally time to become All Might. I am here. What's going on guys, it's Russo and welcome back to another video. Hopefully you guys are having a fantastical day. Today, we're playing my game Anime Tycoon and we got a brand new update. All Might is now in the game. We also added a few more things. We had the All Might Morph with powers, added a passive mode, and we added a character power shop. So let me show you guys how that stuff works. It is essentially a tycoon, similar to like superhero tycoon, but we have way more things and aspects and also our game is way better, just saying. Uh, we have way more aspects to the game. So basically there's five base character show, there, there's five base show tycoons. So we have Death Note, Dragon Ball Z, Naruto, My Hero Academia, and Tokyo Ghoul. In the future, we may add new shows and new tycoons. Whoops. In the future, we may add new shows and new tycoons, but for now, we're just adding new characters and morphs to this dojo shop right over here. As you can tell, it's pretty obvious. And we got a big arrow that says where All Might is, and we're probably gonna do that for every update. So I'm gonna become All Might, show you guys his power, and show you the character shop, and just dominate. So if you guys are excited for this video, don't forget to smash that like button down below. Let's see if we can get to 2,000 likes. We've been hitting almost 2,000 every single video. So first of all, that's insane. Thank you. And I know we can do it. Also, don't forget to subscribe to the channel and hit that notification bell, ding, to never miss a video. Because guys, we are about to hit 400,000 subscribers. Like we're getting, we're at like 386,000 and we're growing so fast that I think we might hit it in the next few days. So I am just so honored and it's gonna be insane. We're gonna hit half a million soon too. Oh my gosh. Without further ado, let's go ahead and purchase All Might. But I just wanna say you can actually complete the Tycoon, become this morph, become All Might, become that morph again, have those powers. Like it's so cool the things that you can do with this game. And I just, I'm so like proud and Ben did such a good job and our ideas finally came to life. Let me just put my attack up real quick. And just let me know in the comments any ways we can keep this game alive and keep this game, you know, going, keep it a top game because it's still a top game front page to second row on popular tab. It's been there for so long since it came out. So I'm hoping we can keep it there. So let me know how we can make it better, anything we can change, anything we can balance and suggestions down below in the comments. But without further ado, here we are. So as you guys know, this is the dojo shop. If you don't know what this is for, basically you get gems. So let me hide this player list real quick. You get gems every single time that you rebirth or when you purchase them from the gem shop right here. So you can get, you know, different prices for different kinds of gems. Um, and then you have your stats right here. So this is your level, level four. Whenever you get to the maximum level that you're currently at, you actually, you can rebirth. So it says right here, if I try to rebirth, you will see 15 rebirth gems and your new max skill will be 50, or new max level will be 59. Your level and skill points will be reset to, to one. So you'll reset your skills, which is sad, but you can get them back as you keep grinding. So that's our version of grinding. We added these amulets that you can unlock for gems. So you can either purchase them for Robux with gems or gems for Robux, or you can just keep leveling up and unlock these. One rebirth will get you this amulet, then you can buy it, it'll get you a little bit, it'll it'll help you level up, then you'll be able to get this one and so on and so forth. So it's, it's pretty easy to level up once you start getting amulets. Um, but we found out that a lot of people are having kind of a hard time to level up in the beginning. So we might even increase experience from NPCs a little bit or add some sort of multiplier every time you rebirth. Um, but there's so many cool things you can do, but let me show you guys the new things. So here is the morphs shop right here. You go to get morphs and there is All Might. It comes with the power Texas smash. As you guys know, that's one of his legendary moves in the show, My Hero Academia. But Basically, we're eventually we're gonna have a ton of morphs in this shop. So this is only the first one that we added. And keep in mind, the game's only been out for like a week, guys. So there's gonna be so many more morphs. It's gonna be morph-tastical. Is that a word? It's gonna be amazing. There's gonna be so many more morphs. They're gonna be all like next to each other right there. They're just gonna look like epic heroes. And they do come with powers. Originally, we were gonna do just costumes and then power separately. But we thought you guys would want powers on every single character, of course. So here's how we did it. You go ahead and you buy now. You don't have enough gems. So I'm gonna go ahead and purchase some gems. I need 10 gems and I, it says that I have four. So I'm gonna buy this 10 gem thing right here. Let's go ahead and buy that. And now we bought All Might. Now let's do the morph. Morph. Yes! So now we are All Might. I am here. <laughs> Dude, I love All Might. I love the way he looks in this game and he, it's just so fun. He's a little bit bigger than most characters too because you guys know in the show, he's pretty ginormous. So yeah, we're gonna be adding a lot more characters. Let me know in the comment section below or you can tweet me or you can go to the Discord 
for Anime Tycoon and let me know like any other characters we should add, any of your favorite animes. But look how epic this is right here. So we go to upgrade powers. Let's go ahead and do that. He can actually fly as well because you guys know in the show he can fly. Um, so seven gems to get this. So I want to upgrade, but I don't have enough gems. I'm going to have to purchase them again. I'll purchase the five. It's only 99 Robux, so I'll do that. And we can upgrade our powers to get fly. So now he has two powers and more coming soon. So eventually the morphs will start having more powers. The base po uh, the base characters like Deku and Light and all them, they're going to have more powers. There's going to be more morphs with more powers and we're just going to have so many updates and cool anime powers and we're going to just try and keep making them fresh and awesome. So I, there's just so much to this game. I don't see it ever falling off, man. I, I, I hope you guys enjoy it and we're going to keep on adding new areas and new powers until just there's so much to this game but look at my texas smash oh no i'm dying all right watch texas smash Duh! <laughs> so it's very similar to deku's power obviously because they have the same power one for all but texas smash is a little bit like more downward i think in the show it's like a downward punch and then i think um in in the show deku's detroit smash which is what we have in this game i think his is more of an uppercut but we're gonna go ahead and switch Deku's animation like in a little bit. It's right now, it's still like kind of similar to this Texas Smash, but look how epic, bro. Yes, I love the sound effects. Like the anime fighting is so fun in this game. Look how insanely overpowered. And then I have the dragon amulet, which is the best amulet. So I get experience incredibly fast. I can almost one hit these guys. Look at this, it's so sick. All right, let me get this cash real quick. There we go. I'm leveling up so quickly, bro. Oh my gosh. Oh. Okay, I'm not as strong as I thought. I forgot because I just rebirthed not too long ago. I am, uh, <laughs> I'm pretty weak. I need to put my attack up a lot. That is definitely what I need to do. By the way, a lot of you guys were asking me about the max skill point. Now, if you still don't know about it, you can actually increase your max skill point in the dojo shop. If you guys saw, like right now, every single time you rebirth, it's kind of like evolving. You're gonna reset your stats and the maximum is still only 50. But if you go over here, you can use the gems that you earn to upgrade your maximum stats. So I can use five gems to do this upgrade right here. And uh, it's pretty awesome that you can do that because now I have a 55 attack. When we were testing the game, I put my attack up to like 600 and it was insanely powerful. So if you grind this game or buy a lot of gems or whatever, you can honestly get super overpowered in this game. So there's, there's just many different ways to play the game. And then it's also a tycoon. So I don't know, like I know I'm biased because it's my game, but I'm just, I love the way the game is and I'm so excited to just see more stuff added to it and just be all might. <laughs> it's so insane, dude. I'm freaking all might, bro. He's like my favorite character ever. Oh gosh, I'm not that strong. Oh my gosh, yeah, my attack is way better now. Okay, I do a lot more damage now. Oh my gosh, I just one hit that guy. I hit him in the head and I like one shot him. Bro, Texas Smash is no joke. Look at this Texas Smash, bro. It's insane. Got him with the Texas Smash. There we go. Okay, so now, now that I'm on the Dragon Ball Z team, I'm I'm not Goku yet. So if you claim a Tycoon as the All Might Morph or any of the other morphs we add to the game, you can still complete the Tycoon like normal and become Goku. And I think if you actually, if you're Goku morph and then you die, like your character gets killed or you reset, I think you become All Might again and you don't have to go all the way back and get him. Um, but I'm not too sure about that, so I'm gonna try it right now. But you can't get Goku or anybody else's powers as All Might or as any of the other morphs. Because obviously that would be unfair, like if you could be like All Might and start using the Death Note, you know what I mean? Because at least people know what they're expecting when they see Light or when they see All Might, you know what I mean? They know what to dodge. But if All Might has the Death Note, it's just, <laughs> it's gonna be the most confusing gameplay ever. So we're not gonna mix and match the powers. See, you do have to actually be All Might. So I can't grab these powers right here. See, you need to be Goku to use this power. And it doesn't actually say that for Fly because I already have Fly. It just doesn't give me an extra Fly. So let's go ahead and use this Morph and we'll become Goku. Ha <laughs> ha, yes. I am no longer here. <laughs> I'm just Goku now. <laughs> all right, so let's go ahead and grab these powers and make sure that all works good, and it does. So now we can use Goku's powers, brah. Look at that key blast, Kai blast. I don't know how to say it, key, Kai. I don't know, all I know is I'm the freaking strongest guy in the galaxy right now. Look at this, super upgrader. And we completed the tycoon. Here we go, there we go. 
We always complete the tycoon so fast just because I have so much yen in my account. Wait, what am I missing? Oh, I'm missing these over here. I was like, I didn't complete the tycoon yet. What did I do? There we go. Now we did it. Yes. I complete. Why are you dancing outside of my building? I will key blast you. <laughs> oh my gosh, I did so much damage. I feel bad. Let's kill these one level guys or these level one guys. There we go. Easy, 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 bro. Easy, easy breezy. Got him. Bro, this guy, no chance. So when you increase your attack power, it also increases the moves you have as well. So uh, I'm a big fan. Thanks. I'm recording, so I can't really reply, but thank you. And then another thing we added, which was a small little touch, but a lot of people were asking about it, is PvP mode off. So if you want to turn it off, you won't be able to attack any players and you can't get attacked by any players. So it's a really good button that helps people that want to just play passively or just grind NPCs and they keep getting bullied by some stronger player. That can prevent you from being bullied. So <laughs> we, we added that and hopefully you guys like it. But yeah, like that's probably gonna wrap it up for this video, but I'm so excited. Like you can be All Might now, even though I'm Goku and I'm not All Might. Let me actually see what happens when I reset because I think I'm not sure if you reset. I know I'm gonna reset into, into my Tycoon, but I can't remember if I'm gonna reset as All Might or not. So you, uh, yeah, you're All Might. So you don't have to go back and get the morph. Like whatever morph you have equipped in the dojo shop, you will always be, even when your character dies. Like if you switch your morph and then you like reset your character like I just did. So that's the cool thing. You don't have to go all the way back to the shop. And eventually we might add like an inventory where you can change your morph like right here, but for now, you have to go to the shop and do it, but let me know again what characters we should add and what powers we should add for all the characters we have. I'm so excited, the game is doing well, and I'm glad you guys like it. Thank you so much for watching, and I've been All Might. I am here. <laughs> Don't forget to like the video, subscribe if you guys are new, and hit that notification bell to never miss a video, guys. Two videos every single day. I don't play. The best in the game. Thank you so much for the support. We're literally about to hit 400,000. I'm blown away every time I say that, but we're gonna hit it very, very soon. So thank you guys so much. I will see you in the next one and have a good one.